Hey guys, this is Joe with Millennium. So we've got 90S's in our rental fleet, and one of the really cool things about the 90S is the CT50 and the Bluetooth technology. We get a lot of questions around it and hope to address those questions today with this video. All right, so with this CT50, I wanna show um, how to get it connected and also what is driving this um, auto rotating. So as we go into the settings, I can click on the Bluetooth icon and we're gonna see the serial number that this is connected with, which uh, does match the cleaver in my hand. Uh, as we go back, we can go into the cleave settings. And here in the cleave settings, we can then choose how automated we want this CT50 to be. So we can choose for this to just automatically rotate when it starts detecting bad cleaves, or we can tell it to automatically rotate, but we have to give it the permission to do it or we manually rotate it by pushing the button on the cleaver. So we have those three choices on how automated we want this cleaver to work. Uh, so if you want to change that logic, we can click right here and change the blade rotation link to alarm and those three options are outlined right there. The next um, logic we can do is telling this cleaver how often it should recommend rotation. Down here at the bottom, we see the logic of if there's three bad cleave errors after 10 cleaves, it's going to automatically um, adjust that wheel. So if you want to change that logic where it's doing it more frequent or less frequent, we can do it here in this screen by adjusting the number of cleave errors to the number of cleaves. All right, so the last thing that I wanna to do today with the Bluetooth technology around this is connect a new cleaver, all right? So here's our new cleaver. We're looking for serial number 554. So when I go to this Bluetooth screen, we need to get a new cleaver paired. So here we have 874 connected and we want to connect a new one. So on our cleaver, there is this link button. I'm going to hold that and that will turn blue. Once that turns blue, we can then um, look for it to appear on the screen here. It's now connected on the screen. I just need to click on that to complete the pairing. Now this is officially connected to this 90S. Give us a call if you got any questions. Um, the, bad, the cleaver will still operate if your batteries run out. You can still cleave, you'll just lose that um, auto rotate functionality. And if you do need to swap the batteries, they're two AAA batteries, nothing special. Give us a call with any questions, thank you.